Hey guys, and thanks for tuning in to my food blog again. Today we're going to do uh, how to make the perfect Philly cheesesteak at home. And this is inspired by a recent visit my family had with Chopped Steakhouse here in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Yeah, New York's pretty fun. Yeah, New York's pretty fun. It's uh, I do travel nursing, so we go all over the country. I homeschool these guys, and uh, so next is Savannah, Georgia. And I, I have no idea what the food's going to be down there, but I can't wait. It's too fun. I grew up, I grew up in Georgia. Did you? Yeah. Okay, so next what's... Next one, I go to Savannah. Um, well, that's where I got offered. I actually had an interview at the psych hospital down there. Oh, really? Yeah, they were looking for a 26-week contract, and I was like, well, you know, wow, good to get out nice. of the snow. All right. Uh, it's nice down there. Um, different. Yeah. Very um, laid back. Slower pace. Much. Much. So you get, the, get that conversion if you're ready for that. Yeah. Because it's very touristy down there. But other than that, there ain't much going on down there. Oh. But it's very good. beautiful. That's okay. But you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of scenery. You're close to Florida. But it is a little quiet. Hell is quiet up there outside of Atlanta where I grew up. It's quiet. I live in Savannah. <laughs> Oh. I know Georgia real well. Yeah, I grew up down there in Georgia. So what should we get to eat? In Georgia? Oh, okay. I know about the pecans and the peaches. Yeah, I mean, that's like the southern typical food stuff. there. You can go find a few southern places. But, you know, everybody's got their thing. Oh. Uh, in Georgia, the southern food, there's, uh, there's a few left. A lot of Mary Max is the number one southern spot in Atlanta. Oh, okay. Now, down in Savannah, you're probably going to get a little more seafood selection. Okay. Going on down there. Cool. A touch of sus touch a cool see i'm all about that we uh i feel like life is too short to eat bad food right and, and if you're that. there you want to go where the local people go and eat because you can find a tourist trap anywhere but got that right. very much so yep so cool pick your cheese Add your veggies like onions, pickles, peppers, lettuce, or tomato are even acceptable too. But it really is all about the chop. Just listen to that. So amazing, isn't it? And it's going to taste so delicious, especially when you add that melted cheese on top. Put it on the perfect toasted white bread roll. And try to eat like a lady, but I admit I was hard pressed. So the next time you're in Philadelphia, stop in and see our friends at Chopped because it was amazing. Until next time, guys. Ciao.